fucking with me? Yeah? Then what you call me in work for? You gonna call me a word, but you can't come out and deal with it. Oh, man. Colin and Mike over there just geeking the ass. Oh, fuck out the car. Woo! Fuck out the shit! Shane Pitch is a, is a rapist. An, he's he's another he's he's another white rapist who got away with raping an underage girl and received no jail time. The only thing he received was ten years probation, even though even though like a a, a violated probation can uh, automatically uh, guarantee you jail time. But uh, let's let, let's just keep it real. Um, uh, we 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 see we see the uh, we see the writing on the wall. We we see how we see the pattern. Okay, he's not the first uh, male. Oh, hold on, excuse me. He's not the first white male to to rape to rape a girl and then get and, and get uh, off with a slap on the wrist. This has been going on continuously. Me, meanwhile, meanwhile, a black man can look like somebody who raped a girl and and do uh, and do. Uh, or do X amount of years in prison, or, or probably die in prison, or leave, leave when he when he's an old man. Like we we we've seen the stories of black men being released from prison after twenty thirty years of a of a uh, crime they they didn't commit. They uh they was accused of rape, and at the time like and like a uh, DNA did not uh did not uh match their DNA they, DNA did not match up with the with the with the crime, and they had to let them go. And these a lot of these men waste away twenty thirty forty years in jail. With wasting away some some of them um some of them are awarded um money, but you know some like that that money that money doesn't make up for the time that you wasted away in prison. But like but uh, Gladys, I mean hold up, but Shane Pitch uh, raped a a, under, a fourteen year old girl. If he, if I'm mistaken, he was a bus driver. He raped a fourteen year old girl, and was only given uh he was only get, given a uh, 10 years probation and like for, for the for the white people who don't think uh white privilege is a real thing this right here is a is a perfect example and the many and the several men who came before who who was uh who was let off scot-free from raping um uh, raping a woman and like um th this this is another perfect example because like um this um this this epidemic of white men raping uh women or raping children and receiving no jail time is it, it, starting to get way out of hand. Matter of fact, it got way out of hand at, uh, the first time around. And I I, I it's like a, of course they didn't reveal the um, the fourteen year old girl. But if I were to bet some money, I would bet that that little girl was a black girl. Cause you know they they damn they don't give a shit about uh. Our, our black women and our black uh, children. <clears throat> so, so like, um, apparently the, 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 the girl had to be either a uh, black or Hispanic, <clears throat> but like the thing is he, he'll, he'll have to look over his shoulder constantly and he, he'll have to watch out for, because, because like now that his face and his image is out there, somebody's going to try to take him out or do something bad to him. But, uh, for the judge, uh, to, to let this man go free without any doing jail time, you you, you just prove the points of mi of mods and so many others about about these white men raping these women or even underage girls and not receiving any jail time. You just proved our point once again. You proved our point over and over and over, and especially um with these black men who are accused of rape when they didn't commit the crime and they get out and they get out 20, 30 years later. You, you have just proved our point about how, how uh, rapists like Shane Pitch uh, get, uh, get off due to the fact that they have the complexion for protection.